Hello, I am back, and today's video is all about me going to the nether and trying to find a nether fortress. If you did not know, to get to the end, which is my next project, it's an enderman farm, you need to get some eyes of ender, which are made with ender pearls, which we'll be doing in a different episode, and, and, um, eyes of ender. So, what eyes of ender need, they need an ender pearl, which we'll do in a different video, and then, in today's video, we'll try and get the blaze rods, to make blaze powder, and, as you can see, off camera, I've made a um, sugar cane farm, and, and because how I got that and I, why I didn't make it earlier was because we needed observers. You need quartz for that, and that was in the Nether. So it hasn't made anything yet because I just finished it. But this iron farm has been producing. A lot of iron so we don't need to worry about iron anymore so these villager breeders are still breeding for some reason still got villagers in here there's a lot of them I did find a looting three guy but he died unfortunately to a zombie but I do have a mending um, enchantment for 36 emeralds. I have bookshelves, which I might use. And then I've got more bookshelves there. These iron golems, I know that they spawn a lot. And I figured out that I can actually kill the, the, the iron golems with my sword. So I got um, some sharp... F I got uh, two sharp threes to make sharp four. I mean, yeah, so how I got that was I got a sharp one, and another sharp one to make sharp two, and I made another um, two sharpness ones to make another sharpness two, and I did that process another time, so I get two sharpness threes to make a sharpness four. Um, my pickaxe, I got really lucky, I got an enchantment, on my bow though I just got power two. Um, iron Axe, just Efficiency 3, and my Iron Shovel, I did a lot of different enchantments for that. So now my Iron Shovel just mines gra grass and dirt like that. So that is nice to have. And the reason that I want to get to the end so quickly is because I really want to grab those wings. If you didn't know it in the end... You get something called an elytra. That is a powerful source that creates you um, the ability to fly. Or glide at least. So, as I said, today we are going to be doing a mission to find... Uh, a nether hub actually before we do that I ha I heard from my father that you can if when you wear a piece of golden armor um, a creature in the nether I can't remember his name wouldn't attack you so he's um, like a minecraft pro I'd say I guess um, and what you need is a piece of golden armor, so you need, so let's just make some golden boots, because they have the least protection, let's make those golden boots now, and now, when I see them, if I put them on, they won't attack me, hopefully, so that's, only, I'm only going to put them on if I see them, because I don't want to put them on, because they might break because they don't have the best durability. Here we go with the 
portal once again. And here we are again in the nether. So I'm going to start the journey and when I find it, I will be back. So here we are and I just found out that there's a base spawner right here. So this, this is what we need, the blazes. And if he comes back... Don't have an arrow, do I? No, I don't have an arrow. I can't use my bow. No, I need to get him. He needs to come. Come to me. Mate. Um, I need to grab myself. Come on. Come on, dude. You don't want to do this to yourself. Yes. Alright, I've got one blaze rod. Into fire. Is the advancement we get for it. Ow. You. Come back down. Let's have a tussle. You scared me. Come on. No. You did not hit me. I don't have feather falling. So I don't want to. Yes. We've got two blaze rods. Got to get back up there. Oh these new sounds when you break them blocks. There we go. Oh, we didn't get one for that. Right, so I'm just going to farm this for a bit. And, come on. We need this. You. You're in there. Multiply. Put yourself around. Because I need to kill you. you no, know, it's a lot to ask. But I need to take your life. For these things. <gasps> there you are. Dead. Dead. No. Dead. Oh, we didn't get one that time. Alright, I'm just going to light it up. I'm not sure if they need light to spawn or if they spawn without light. Oh yes, we've got another blaze rod. Okay, so I'll be back when I get about 20 to like 25. So, I just... Oh no. So, I just gathered 27 of these blaze rods. Took me about 10 minutes. So now I'm going to start to head back. And I'll see you guys when I'm back at the portal. Bye. So I'm just rocking up on the nether portal. And so if we go back through. I've got a few um, blaze rods as you already know because I just told you um, and I actually want to create a general mob, mob farm this episode mainly that's what I was gonna do this is now my like nethery chest I guess you could say yeah this is like a nethery chest I got from the nether so I have I, I'm going to make it out of cobblestone. So let's grab all of this. And do I have any other cobblestone? Yep, there's some cobblestone. So how you make it is it's like a big tower with water in the middle. So it's like a... It's two endermen here. Need to kill them. There we go, I need to kill these Enderman for Ender Pulse. Ah, no. So I can get my Eyes of Ender. Mate, you don't want this, you don't want this, you don't want this, you don't want this. There we go, they're dead. He's exploded. That's fine. There we go. So, before I was interrupted by that, I... So, how you build this farm? Oh, yes, Iron Golem. So, you make a big platform. Or a big tower. So I'm going to do the tower method. 
So my tower is going to be that big. So I'm just going to build this up until it's high enough. So I'll see you when it's high enough. This is the height that I want my tower. If I fall down there, I'm most likely going to die. So what I'm going to do is make the four different platforms. And there's a hole in the middle that the mobs walk into. So I'm going to put trap doors on the way. So I need to make the seven blocks. I think that's way more than seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I think it is seven. Not entirely sure. So let's do that, and if it's not enough, then we just dig that down one more, and you can put a sign there or something to block the water. So this is going to be the platform, and in there is going to be the water that's going to push the mobs apart into this hole. So I need to create this here. And I'm going to put a time lapse of me building the whole tower and the platforms. Three, two, one, roll time lapse. So here is one platform, and I am just going to make the other three, and then I'll be back. So I just finished the, um, what's it called? The actual mob farm itself. But now comes the tricky part of putting all of the source blocks down I did a few of them but they were done by ice and I don't know why because there isn't any light sources but over there doesn't have the light that is needed for this to work so I'm gonna just let them go down and I also don't know why this isn't working but okay so that's all fine you can break them and do that I've got to a block there block there there and there do that and I'm not fine I need to put another no ow mm. that is so annoying but now I have to build up do other things no 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 I don't want to I don't want to do that there we go so now they will go center while that's there. It's just like that. Whenever anything comes, it just gets pushed out of the way. I don't know why, but up there, the light level is 13. So therefore, mobs cannot spawn. There we go. So mobs can't actually spawn up there. Oh, I lost my stake. So I need to destroy this bit. So now I need to keep that like that. I need to go under this and my crafting tables to do that. And I need to make some slabs. Also need to make some stairs. So 
the stairs are full for that. And slabs. Going like this. And then you just whack away like this. And then you should be golden. The only thing we need to do is make sure that creepers, when they spawn, can't see us. Because then what happens is this thing goes kaboom. So I'm going to stand here. Kaboom. So when creepers don't blow me up before I actually finish, um, I will be standing here. I'll be going slice, slice, and slice with my um, sweeping edge. I don't actually have that enchantment. Um, let's just put that like that. Light can actually stick through, so I need just to put a block there, a block there. Finished, like that. So I will be standing here, swinging, move the stair like that. And I can swing like this. I might just do it like that. And then I just swing like that. And then I could have a, um, a thing. So when I just do that, I can just AFK, just swinging like that. So all of the mobs die. So that's this now completed mobs should start to fall down though well, they won't because I still need to put the trap doors up there so I'm gonna go and do that so let's put all this cobblestone back because I do not need it no more don't need it anymore so I should have said double negative there but we have our ender pearl. Um, that's the most important thing at the moment. We have the ender pearl. Um, we're gonna need some wood for the trapdoors. Let's just make a few of them. Um, let's use this to go trapdoors. Nope. That is not working for me, so I'm just gonna craft them. Looks like that's not enough. So I guess let's just do this. So you have 20, that's 40. So that's about, yeah, so that's about a stack and 12. That should be enough. So, I need some blocks to get up there, so let's just go get my cobblestone again, because I just got to do that, because it closes the door. Um, I don't need to go in there, however, I do need to get a stack of cobblestone, so I can use a scaffolding. Here we go, we're just slowly going up, 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 away we go to heaven, up. Up, up, away we go. Do you hear that? You've already got some mobs in here. And they're all spiders. Spiders are the only problem in this farm. Because they will just climb on all of the walls. And we don't want them to climb on walls. Because that's not how the farm is supposed to be working. So there we go. Got this. I just need to put trapdoors like this so then they walk in the water. Because if you guys didn't know, um, when mobs see trapdoors like this, they think it's like that so they can just walk. However, when it's like that, you'll fall 
down and you will die. Well, you won't die because that fool doesn't kill you, but I will kill all the mobs with my sharp four sword. Yippee! I might need to get more trapdoors. I don't think so. But if I do, then I will. If I don't, then yay. I might need a few. Cause I do 22. Per, I think I'll be really close to finishing. But I won't be done. Especially if I do that because I need all the trapdoors that I get from here. Can't really be doing that because that's just wasting all the trapdoors. So you just got to open all of these. Yeah. The last one I have 24. Okay, we have enough. We have enough. I don't need that trapdoor. And eight to spare. That's good. So there we go. And the glitch that I was talking about was this. So here, if I do F3, you can see that here uh, it says light somewhere. Yeah, here, light 12. It has to be 7 for mobs to spawn. So keep looking there, it's 12, and then immediately 0. And I don't know why. If I do this, this is now 10, 9, 8, and this is just 3. Now when I come over here, it's 0. What a 1. And I don't know why. So I think it might just be a glitch. Or it might just be that the game doesn't like me and it wants me to not have a mob farm. Or it could just be that it's a bit buggy. Because games normally can be buggy. So that is going to wrap up the end of today's video. So if you guys did enjoy, then hit that like button, subscribe, comment. And improvements again. I know I keep asking, just I really want to make this the best content for you, and so I can enjoy making and editing all of these videos. So I will see you guys in the next one.